Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have an epic unboxing for you of a sample piece, the first one in my collection. Can you believe out of everything that I have, I don't have one of those, but before we get into it, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Hit that notification bell so you're notified every time that I upload a new video. And without any further ado, let's get into the video. All right, here we are. This came all the way from Brooklyn, New York. I'm so excited to get into this. It's a little bit of a small box. It's a little bit on the smaller side, but I can't wait. So let's get into it. All right, you guys, I'm super excited for this. Like, thank you so much, Harmony. Shout out to you. This is the second one that you have enabled me with. The first one was my offer up video that wasn't the greatest but we were able to have a resolution for that i sent it back the seller did ignore me and whatnot but offer up stepped in and said hey we approve your uh, return go ahead here's your shipping label it was free return shipping so glad that was all sorted out i'm still waiting for my refund they said it was going to be three days but it's been longer than that so i'm gonna wait a couple more days before i reach out but let's get into this because i'm so excited about this like i said this is a sample piece and this is a first one in my collection i picked this up from ebay have you guys ever purchased from ebay before go ahead and let me know in the comments section i know a lot of people are scared about it um but i've had good experiences i've had a few purchases that came all the way from japan this is my first one that's here locally Wow, okay, so this seems like an experienced seller for sure. She has a little like card with a QR code on it. It says visit my Etsy shop, 10% off. Interesting, I love that. And here we are. So this is supposed to be brand new, never used. Little backstory on it. I reached out to the seller just to verify a couple things before I made a purchase. I don't think she knew that she had a sample piece, but this was a gift to her, and maybe it just wasn't her style. It's very unique. I love the fact that she sealed it in an envelope, a plastic envelope. Okay. Let's hope this is perfect because there's no returns. Right, here we are, you guys. I'm excited for this. Love, 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 love the color already. Can you guys see? Look at that. Uh, that is so stinking cute. Look at that. Oh my goodness. I love this saddle color with that orange pop. Let me get the handles out. Look at that. So this is part of the Coach Spring 2022. Uh, they had a fashion show last year and this was featured in it. So from what I'm being told and what I've figured out is that this is a sample piece. So with sample pieces, not too much information is out there. Um, but a lot of times they just make a few, a couple, sometimes even just one of a bag just to see if they're going to like the design, like the colors and this difference between a Photoshop rendering and actually seeing it in person. But this is a sample piece. So this very well could have been the piece that was on the runway. If you guys look up uh, Coach Spring 2022 fashion show you will see this on the runway but this is featured in the coach uh, 2022 spring collection and you will see this bag on the runway so this very well could be the exact bag that was on that runway i'm like so excited about this and what I love is, you guys know Stuart, the creative director for Coach. He's injected a lot of fun and a lot of new life into Coach. And one of the things that he wanted to do for Coach was pay, uh, pay homage to um, institutions in New York City. One of them being Zabar's. Zabar's is a deli. They got amazing bagels. And you could just pick up like charcuterie stuff, a sandwich, deli stuff related like that. And I just thought this was so fun that they slapped the bagel and the logo onto this bag. How playful is that? I think that is so stinking adorable. 
let's let's do a little tour so now that you guys have gotten a little background so we're looking good we're looking good i mean if this was on the runway she looks amazing so coach also did a bunch of other institutions in new york city serendipity three uh pearl paint and my personal favorite that i'm so excited to come out is the new york eagle if you know you know Ow. and that one's all black and it has the eagle logo in the front what a conversation piece that's going to be uh that's not quite yet available though this is available to order so if you guys know that not all pieces make it from the runway to the production line, it's like a concept car or something of that nature. They come up with an idea, they make a one-off, and then afterwards, eventually, they do or they don't come out with it. But by the time they do come out with it, there's a lot of variations and not as much as into it. So this was the original idea that Stuart had in his mind, and I'm so excited to have this in my collection, and I'm so excited for that Eagle NYC bag to come out. It's going to have three sizes, so I'll try to insert here and here pictures of the cashins. So spring 2022 is going to be all about the cashin. There's going to be so many variations, the way that they had rogues, different variations of them, they're going to do cashins. So there is a mini, uh, which is a little bit shorter than this. I believe it's just as wide, um, but it's just a little bit shorter. This is the regular size, I guess you could say, or the medium. Uh, there's not any official announcements about it yet. And they will have a large, um, a little bit bigger than this. They all have these little skinny handles, which to me, I would prefer like thicker handles just in proportions with the bag and I'm always worried like there's going to be an issue of this breaking or you know just if you load this up too much I'm worried that it's going to snap but I mean if you look at like the Louis Vuitton Neverfulls like those bags have these skinny straps and those things I have seen them packed to the gills over and over and over and over and not have any issues so I'm expecting that this is going to be right up there, if not even better, for the quality. And a bonus about these, so it does come with a crossbody strap. But with these little dainty handles, like the way it was packaged in here, you can actually put them inside without having to worry about messing them up. And then it has a little crossbody option and you can wear a crossbody. How cute is that? So, like I said, this is one of the only uh, styles that's currently available to order. It hasn't been officially launched, released, showing up in stores, nothing like that yet. But this is one of the ones that's available to order. So, if you guys reach out to your essay, you guys let them know that you're interested in the uh, regular size cash-in um, with the Zabar's logo on it, they'll be able to order it for you. Now, keep in mind, though, that this is a sample piece, so there might be different variations. So by the time it made to production, I can see this one has 1941 line, canvas lining on the inside, but my Buy Now cash in that I had in my Black Friday haul, that one actually has leather lining. So by the time they make it into production, uh, they could have changed some things, but this, I've seen pictures of the production version on the outside and it looks exactly like this. So what you see is what you can expect, uh, what you see is what you can expect when you order through an essay. It's available to order. It's not yet in stores. It's not yet online. It could take some time. Original glove tan leather there. Four feet. I love that this has feet because I just love the sound when you put your bag down. Uh, but let's get into the inside of it. Okay, so it has this kind of crossbody leather moment. So keep in mind, you guys, the Buy It Now cash in that one had a canvas kind of webbing strap um, that was thicker and a lot more fun to the eye for sure. Um, some people prefer this type of leather strap. I personally prefer um, the other webbing kind of strap. Um, and like I said, the seller, this was a gift to her. So this wasn't anything that she used at all. It was gifted to her. And I guess she decided that, you know, it just wasn't her style, which is totally fine because it's my style. And I'm so grateful. 
Look at the inside, you guys. Okay, so this, like I said, this one has the 1941 canvas lining. Unlike the Buy Now Cash, and that one has a leather lining. Pros and cons to each one of them. This one's going to be a lot more durable. You don't have to worry about getting scratched or uh, damaged, opposed to the leather. The leather will get uh, scratched or damaged or uh, stained a lot easier and harder to clean, but it just feels more luxurious to me. So this, you can, you know, soap and water, scrub it out if you need to, if you spill anything in there. Okay. So this might be a little hard to see, but if you guys look in the pocket back there, you guys see that barcode? That's one of the uh, tall tale signs that this is a sample piece. So when they get these in, they scan them in, they check them in, and I believe um, per look, they scan it and they have the look breakdown. So this bag is gonna go with this outfit, with this model, she's gonna wear it. So that is a good indication that this is a sample piece. So that's like a, it's like a barcode that they sew into it into the lining there and let's look at the creed which that'll give you guys a this is a coach bag a reimagination of the cash and carry shopping bag from 1956 or 1966 it is crafted in natural leather it reflects our commitment to rethinking and reducing our impact on the planet wear it love it repair it pass it on so the style number on this patch on the creed is zero 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 so i don't know if you guys can see all the way in there but it is all zeros down at the bottom of the bag i'll see if i can insert like a picture of it um so that is another sign that this is a sample piece this is something that could have been on the runway. This is something that could have never even went into production. So I'm guessing I've never seen any other of these floating around there. So for me, for my sake, this was on the runway and this just gets me so uber excited about this because can you guys imagine owning the actual piece that was on the runway? Like that's like, pfft mind blown like it went from the fashion show and i can go on youtube if you guys are interested go to youtube type in coach spring 2022 fashion show and it will pop up you'll get to see this specific bag on the runway and everyone that they've planned to come out with there's so many cute variations of this there's um some with like belts going across it. There's even one that's actually made out of a vintage baseball glove. They turned it into a bag. I think that is so stinking amazing. Um, what else do they have? Like I said, the Eagle one. They have this one, the Serendipity 3, Pearl Paint. Um, so if you guys are familiar with New York City, if you guys are fans of those institutions, this is going to be something that's going to be amazing to add to your collection that I absolutely love. And I definitely will be wearing this with care. I think I might even use that little pink um, the strap that came with my other cash in. I think that'd be a fun, another pop of color. It would be even more amazing if it was orange. I love that this popped up because you guys, when I got my buy now cash in, um, it was the only one that popped up on the site. I immediately bought it. And online, it looks like the Vachetta natural leather in person, it's a little bit more like a yellow tinge to it. They call it vanilla. But the thing was, so with the buy now cash -ins, I absolutely love the saddle color. And the saddle color came with the orange field toad strap. And I absolutely love that color combo of the saddle with the orange. That's, I believe it's like a dark saddle because it's darker than this. But I love that color combination. So I was like, I love my buy now cash -in, but I wish it was saddle and... Here we are. Now this has filled the void. Now not only is this the saddle color that I wanted with orange on it, but it is a sample piece. So this very well could be the only one produced of this kind. So I'm over the moon. I'm so excited about this, you guys. Like this is like above and beyond. And like me just looking at this, like the stitching is so straight. 
every detail is perfection on it. So I get like the feeling, I get the vibe that they put like a little bit extra more work into this bag just to make it perfect. Because if this is going to be on the runway, if this is going to be on Vogue, if this is going to be on every magazine editorial, it's got to be perfect. So it just looks phenomenal. Like I am so ecstatic. Like Thank you so much to the seller that's based in Brooklyn. Whoever gave you this, they are amazing. And I would need a friend like that too. Like that has the hookup to the sample sales because from what I've been told, sample sales, you have to be invited to it or know about it, show up super early and you get what you get. Like the stuff on the runway is available for sale and this is one of them. And she was gifted this and it just wasn't her style, but it's fine. I This is my style, a bagel on the front. Look at that, that saddle color with that pop of orange. It is adorable and it is a great size. I think this is gonna be like a great, like everyday size just to hold all my essentials. And I'm excited for this. I'm excited for that uh, Eagle NYC one to come out and I want the larger one. I'm so excited for this, you guys. Can't like stop saying excited because like this is such an epic piece in my collection. No, oh, and you know what I just noticed? It matches, the orange matches the orange. Um, I did not plan this. This just happened that my ring matches the orange there. So you guys, I'm so excited for this bag. I'm going to go play with it. I'm going to go compare it to my other buy now cash in that I have and see what the similarities or what differences it has. I'm super over the moon about this. Thank you guys for joining me on this amazing unboxing. I will catch you guys on the next one. Stay beautiful. Bye.